This person wants to know, is it possible to stream retro games but also view the game on a separate CRT monitor? Well, there sure is, so today we're going to talk about video splitters. First you're going to need a video splitter. I have two here and I'll show you the difference between them. This Radio Shack one you can buy on Amazon right now for $40, but it only has composite and S-video. This is the CalRad 40-934M. This one can be found on eBay used for $20, and it has component video as well as composite and S-video. I'll be demonstrating using the CalRad in my PlayStation 1. First, plug your console's video cables into the input ports of the splitter. Next, plug in the cables going to your TV to any of the outputs. Then, plug your cables going to your capture card into any of the outputs. Then you can power on your console and you should be able to see your video on your TV and your capture card. Oh, and one more thing, make sure that the splitter you buy is powered. If it's just passive, you could lose some video quality.